I have a feeling this video might come off as negative or less than optimistic regarding Trenton Simpson. I really don't want that to be the case. I might ask that you check out the two videos I did upon him being drafted. I was at the time and I remain very excited about him as it regards his versatility in particular. I think he's best in space. I think him at inside linebacker is an uphill climb. Of course, a lot may have changed or it may still change before the Ravens year begins. And it's quite possible he may make great strides in just soaking in what Pat and Roquan do. We see Trenton here as an apex defender in more of a nickel role. He seems to have a much easier time in space finding the football. I do think he struggles getting off blocks at times, but he's aggressive in his pursuit and he does find the football and get in on this play. Watch it again. We see him here lined up more as a 4-3 Sam. He does have violence in his hands as you see him take on this tight end. Here he does a nice job kind of sinking his hips and firing, locking out his arms, changing the line of scrimmage, being disruptive in the backfield. Watch it again. We see him here lined up over the nose. It's going to be part of this stunt to work back into the opposite A-gap. Does a good job timing this up, getting in the throwing lanes, knocking this football down. This is a look you'll see out of, let's say, Patrick Queen. But I have to say there's not a lot on tape of him in traditional drops, getting into hook flat, hook curl. He's often called upon in Clemson's defense just to crash gaps, regardless of down, is to just crash his gap once the ball snapped. So in some sense, that's very unsatisfying to watch when you're trying to see how he might project in the Ravens scheme. He doesn't end up making the play here, but that might have more to do with the defensive linemen being bounced out of their gaps. I do like his take on the uncovered center is going to come to get Trent, and Trent's going to meet him at the line of scrimmage. I do like what this shows us about Trenton. This take on attacking the play side shoulder, you can see he's got real good length and some good pop in his hands. And again, you get some movement of the D-line uh, on the interior here, and this back makes a nice cut inside of him. He clearly could be described as developmental at the inside linebacker position. One of the things that shows up on tape a lot, and to me, it's probably because he's new at the position, is he has a hard time finding the football. And you can't be around the football as a linebacker if you can't find it. He has a fair amount of work to do in terms of reading the offensive line, reading his keys, being decisive. You can see he's after the quarterback at this point, has no idea where the football is. We're going to look at that a few more times because it shows up a lot. Trenton is our sole linebacker in the box. It's clear he's coached to read the backfield exclusively. Doesn't appear too aware of what's going on in front of him. This right tackle's coming to get him. They're running GT counter. You can see him take some false steps and he falls for this toss to the back or fake toss. He runs himself out of the play and into this block as this play is set up. Watch it again. At linebacker, he's got to be able to be predictive intuitive he's got to be able to find a football we see him in his gap here we see him really get caught up at the line of scrimmage it looks at this point he's got a very clear bead on the football the ball carrier and that he's going to step out and make a play and then you can see he doesn't know where the football is watch it again Clemson is going to crash this defensive end and scrape Trenton over the top. I'd like to see him set a strong edge and keep this back from bouncing. Watch it again. We see him here again, lined up as an apex defender. Very natural in space he is. In one-on-one -on -one take-ons, he consistently dominates tight ends. But again, needs to work on finding the football, and in this case more particularly, just shedding, getting off, disengaging, and finding this ball carrier. 
Good pursuit afterward. Here's Trenton off the edge. Again, he's a playmaker in space. I do think he's aggressive and plays with violence. Got that good length. Spends himself to get the ball carrier. And strips the football. Watch it again. <laughs> 